Good morning, boys and girls. This is Mr. Giomini. I am back in school after a short little trip away from you guys. Thought about you guys. I uh, obviously probably saw I continue to put posts on the blog, so hopefully you guys utilize those in my absence. You took a quiz last Friday, and one of the questions that I noticed that we struggled with was number 16, the very last question. So I want to take a, a moment to analyze that question and, and show you how I would go about solving it. So looking at the question, I'm going to get my highlighter here. Macy is going to make six beaded keychains for gifts. She purchased 24 beads for each keychain. She reduced the number of beads per keychain by nine to save money. Develop an expression that will show the total number of beads she will need to make all of the keychains. Show and explain how you use the expression to solve the question of how many beads Macy will need to purchase in order to make all of her keychains. Okay, a lot of information there. First thing I know, obviously Macy's making keychains, probably for friends, something like that. Now, she's making six beaded keychains. So I'm going to go down here, and I'm going to, once I highlight, I'm going to actually write some of this information down. So, six keychains. So she's making six keychains total. Okay, now what I want to take a look at, let's see here. Originally, I, I noticed there was some operation going on here. It said something along this. So she purchased 24 beads for each keychain. So originally, it was going to be 24 beads per keychain. Okay. She will reduce, reduce, I think, means to subtract the number of beads per keychain by 9. So. All right, so I'm going to write this stuff down here so I don't forget it. So, so it was 24 per keychain. I'm going to call it chain just to kind of shorten my work here. Per chain. But we're going to take away 9 from that. So it's 9 fewer or 9 less than the 24. Now, let's go back to the problem here. Develop an expression. Now, it doesn't say algebraic, so I don't need a variable per se. Develop an expression that will show the total number of beads she will need to make all of the key change. Show and explain how you use the expression to solve. Use the expression to solve the question of how many beads Macy will need to purchase in order to make all of her key change. So, First thing I want to do here, let's see if I can make an expression, because that's the first part here, develop an expression. So that's definitely one thing I need to do. So I know that whatever it is, how many beads she takes, I'm going to multiply that by six. So if she had a, if she's making only a two bead keychain, and she's making six, it'd be six times two, and then she needs a total of 12 beads. Well, obviously that's not how many she's making. She's not using two beads per 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 keychain, but she's using 24 beads per keychain originally, but she's going to reduce that number by 9 to save money. Now this number sentence here will tell me how many beads she needs, or she's going to use per keychain. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to multiply that by 6. Now it is important that I put this in parentheses. If I don't, it says 6 times 24 minus 9, where order of operations tells you to multiply 6 and 24 first. So what I want to do first is figure out how many beads are required total. If I take that, I go 6 times, I'm going to do parentheses first, PEMDAS. 24 minus 9 gives me 15. I go 6 times 15 gives me 90. So she'll need a total of 90 beads to make those 6 key chains. Now, some of you did this, and I thought it was pretty clever. You did this. You said 6 times 24, and then you subtracted that from if she were to make it from 6 with just 9 beads per. So 6 times 24 gives me 144, and then you subtract that because that would be 144 beads if she made 6 keychains with 24 beads each. You subtracted that from 6 times 9, which gives you 54. I subtract that. That gives me 90, and that also gives me 90 beads. That was another way to go about it. Now, I showed. So I have developed an expression. I showed. Now I need to explain. I'm going to type this out because sometimes I type a little bit neater than I write. Well, all the time I do. So 
I need to type out now how I was thinking. Let me reduce this font. Okay. Macy will need a total of 90 beads to make six keychains. My expression is six times 24 minus 9 I used this expression because I know that I can take the number of beads needed for one keychain and times it by six to get how many beads are needed in all. I used 24 minus 9 because originally Macy wanted 24 beads per keychain but then reduced that number by 9 to save money 24 minus 9 equals 15 so Macy will have 15 beads per keychain one keychain equals 15 beads two equal 30 beads and then six would equal 90 beads Hope this helps you guys out. Uh, some of you didn't want to retake, we will discuss the possibilities of taking a retake today in class. And you can then come to me later this week and discuss what you're going to do in order to improve your overall score. Thanks for listening. Take a good day. Have a good day. Bye-bye.